the one to the right. I don't know who he is yet until I see his face. Just walk over there. Oh, it's Cotton. Do you know all of them? Every single one. Really? That's Cotton right there. Yeah. His girlfriend actually is my kid's teacher. Oh, wow. Was, was he hitting on you? Oh, okay. <laughs> was he like, like smashing you? I have a band. I have a band, Well Development. Well Development is my band. I'm the devil. I love it. Why are they blocking the whole street? I don't know. It's kind of. Did you see the tactic? You missed it. He was facing me, now he's got his back towards me. Yeah. So I can't like see his lips, I'll, I'll like zoom in on his mouth so I can hear him. He's a mask on. What? He's a mask on. Who? Well, it's an automatic tactic though. Oh yeah, just yeah. So, like... Yeah, because when, when they're talking, it's unidirectional, so if he's facing me, I'll be able to hear him a lot better than if he was faced the other direction. Bro, you need to check yourself in like five minutes ago, bro. Dude's like talking about the devil and shit. There's nothing we can do. I'm all set with you, sir. Okay. So, Luke. Appreciate you guys coming so quick. I'll give you a call if I'm Okay. Thank you. You have a age. You'd never age, dude. I didn't press you here. I didn't press you. that guy going? I know, you want to follow him? Go follow him. His cruise is right here. Hey, be careful. If there's, if there's civilians at the store, try not to get them because they're kind of eating. Uh, JP cop chases and I have no idea what's going on but it looks like a social issue something like that Looks like this guy caused a disruption. I'm not sure if there's a victim involved in this or not. But, uh, so who's over here behind me is 3183. And uh, this cop car over here. Is uh, two one eight four. The other one is three one eight fifteen. That three one eight one five fifteen. Don't like to get civilians in the shot if I have to. At least ones that aren't involved anyway. <laughs> you can tell this uh, cop to the right, who I'm kind of unfamiliar with, is very uncomfortable with me being here. <laughs> to say the least. I don't have my press pass on, but these, these cops know who I am.
Hey, what's going you on? All that? What's that? You getting all that? Yeah, I'm always. Not surprised to see you. Steve. Hey, how are you? I'm good. Daylight forever, he says. <laughs> Who's he talking to? Daylight forever. Damn it, I couldn't get through a non monetized video. Monetized video. <laughs> oh, I got it down. This guy right here is detained for something. Do you know what he's being detained for? I don't know. He's talking about holding the sun up by the power of God and all kinds of oh shit. Yeah. He's like all over the place. Yeah. <laughs> is your car open? Yeah. But no, it's locked. You always leave it alone. Always leave it alone? Always, yeah. We will never ever be far enough for anything to happen to it. So if we have to run into it, it's next to it's over there. I just need to grab my press bag. Do you have a secondary radio? No? I had one. Do you have a charger for them? At my house. Um, what, what I usually did was I had a radio always in my car. I should have plugged mine in because I could have just let you use one of mine. Or at least the battery anyway. Well, I had one that was always in my car and plugged into the uh, cigarette lighter. Yeah. And then Ian gave me that one. A few weeks ago. Do you know how many I've bought in off of him, dude? Like 30? I'm not even exaggerating. Not, not even exaggerating. You can buy them on Wish now, though. You really? just bring them to Ian, he'll flash them for you. How much do they go for? 25. Oh, wow. I thought those were a lot more expensive than that. No. You can buy really, really cool looking ones, like pink ones, and green oh, ones, and camo ones. I want a tank one. Yeah. But his all his flash equipment and all that, all that uh, equipment is gone. 
the repeater's like the repeater's there. They're yeah, trying but to fix it today, so they're trying to go. well, he has to flash the encryption with the radios to the repeater, and they took the, that computer. <laughs> yeah. So, have you heard anything about what's going on from over here? He keeps asking him if he can go, and they're like, "No, you're being detained." So, okay. But they're letting him like kind of be free. Yeah. They're like, you want to sit down? He's like, no. He goes, okay, you can stand up. So from what we heard over there, he was walking across the street, and I guess there was a car coming, and the car stopped to let him walk. And then I guess he turned towards the car, and started like raising his fist and like screaming at the car. He's going to probably get arrested for disorderly, but they'll let him out or get an eval. He needs a fucking eval, dude. How are you? Oh my god, I can't wear a mask, like, seriously. I'm double vax, bitch. <laughs> did, you already, did you get both of them? Yeah, because I'm high risk. Yeah. Yeah. Did you, you already need third limbs? No, I didn't want to, but I did, like, a ton of research. Yeah. Like, I worked, watched, like, a gazillion videos. They were working on the vax from the COVID-1, from SARS. Um, on TVs about me. I guess if you were gonna get it, doing a lot of research would probably be the best thing. I would say bipolar bipolar disorder with psychotic features with grandiose properties. DSM chapter four. A, B, and C. That's like borderline schizoaffective. Yeah. <laughs> Did you hear what he said? He said all you see is me on TV. Everything you see is me. What he just said. Narcissist. No, that's not a narcissist. See, a narcissist. A lot of females get a narcissist wrong. My dad was a narcissist. These guys literally think they're king shit, and they woman, like they demean everybody around them, and they think they're smarter than all of them. And then if you try to like Perfect. take take that control away just a little bit, you know, a bunch of those kind of people. Yeah, those are more prominent people to be like drunks and alcoholics. You know, the reason why I've never drank a day in my life, 46 years sober, no weed, cigarettes, nothing, is because I witnessed my father beating the crap out of my mom at like four or five years old. So I put the link together really early. So like alcohol and all that stuff gives me anxiety. Like I never liked being around it. I'm like the guy that pulls my friends out of their pew, carries them upstairs, bails them out of jail, like stops fights. Thing figure out how to get them out of charges when the car's in the ditch. I'm that guy. <laughs> Sorry for being verbally out loud. Is that what he said? Yeah. He might, he might get nailed for uh, disorderly. I think I said... You're all set. Is that him that's so bad? I think he said we're all set because that, not that he's all set to go. Is he all set to go? I said, I said, they were kind of screaming at him until we showed up. Now they're all like, I'll be a nice one. Luke is really cool though. Luke's a good dude. I feel like this guy's my first arrest him. That'd be really neat. Not for him, for us. All right, thank you. What do you say? No, you can't leave? Because he was trying to leave a minute ago and the cop kept doing this. Yeah, he's saying come here. He's saying come here. Probably trying not to make a scene. I'm going to stand over here. Get all the cops. They're kind of relaxed right now. One extra because there's nothing going on. Exactly what it is. <laughs> we need one more because there's nothing going on. Maybe they call them in because they need them. Now that guy, douchebag from hell. I was like, I was like, he kind of looks like a dick. Yeah. That's Benjamin Bitch Nugent. Benjamin Bitch. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Not 
when they kind of process them, I'll say it right out loud to them. I should show them the picture of the check. The one from Keem, uh, Manchester PD. Can I ask you how much it is? I'll show you. I can't say it out loud. That was from them pushing you? Okay. Uh, arresting me for filing a complaint. Oh. And this guy actually threatened me with it once, too, uh, why that case was going on, because he thought he had brass balls. And that's what happened, like a lot of the cops. So with the bail reform, he's just gonna get let go, or they're gonna like force him to get an eval. Well, it's past five, so he's spending the night, right? No, they got bail commissioners. The bail reform, they, if it's not a felony or a violent crime, they have to let him go, even if he doesn't have the money. Oh. Yeah. I mean, if he didn't do anything violent, he'd probably release him from the PR, right? Yeah, yeah. The court can institute fines uh, and a bail fee after, after your arraignment. But they can't be held if you're poor. But he he noticeably needs help. Like he noticeably needs to be checked in somewhere. <laughs> right, right. I can't get pretty close. We're good across from here, right? Yeah, go ahead. I got it down. Oh, Thank you. Can do an interview if you want. Okay. We saw nothing. You got you got a radio voice. <laughs> oh, go ahead. Go ahead. When you live in a town, you gotta like kind of respect the public a little bit. That's something Garrett Ian and a lot of the Robin Hooders didn't do. They would like stick in cameras in people's faces. I'm like, you can't do that. Yeah, see, the only time I'll like stick a camera in someone's face is if they're like aggressively approaching me. Yeah, if they're threatening me, I don't even need the camera. I'll just fucking smack them. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have armor in that vest? No? Yeah, it's Kevlar. Yeah. It's crazy that felons can't have it. Really? Yeah. That felons can't have Kevlar, which is stupid. You would think they would so need it, it more than... Plate? Is it just a front plate and a back plate, or is it side plates, too? What? They're medium. Medium plates front and back. It makes it lightweight. So it's, it's, a, it's a media It's a media vest. What do you think it's rated at, too? I don't know, probably strong, strong enough for, yeah, oh yeah, 22, 9 mil, a 3 away will probably shatter my freaking chest cavity, but I'll be, I might survive. You might survive it. bitch. Bye, bitch Nugent. See that check? Do you see that check? That's a settlement for arresting me for filing a complaint. Do you remember you, like, threatened me to arrest me for filing a complaint? You don't remember that? Well, stay safe, man.